Hey there YouTube, this is SGM4306 back with another video and this guy I'd shown you guys in a, um, a past video. This was a little tiny VFT clock that I designed and I just wanted to show you guys I added some updates to the software. Now you'll see the um, last digit there on the right no longer the um, top segment is no longer always stuck on. So ones and fours display correctly now, yay. So anyway, uh, beyond that, you can see the power consumption draw. I can actually adjust the brightness. And you can see this is at the lowest brightness. It draws a little over half a watt at um, 124 milliamps. And we can take that all the way up to full brightness. And obviously, you can hear it beeping once it gets to the end of the adjustment. Um, range it'll stop beeping when you click the button so you can see at full brightness it doesn't look that much brighter but you know, on the camera but in real life it definitely is um, you can see it's drawing about 1.15 1.16 uh, watts at 235 milliamps so we'll just turn that back down to about middle of the range and to um, set the time now, so that's if you're just clicking the buttons, set the time, you press and hold the hours until it gives you a beep, and then that'll allow you to, to then advance the time using the two buttons. And then if you wait about five seconds, it'll um, beep and then exit time setting mode. There you go. Now you can continue adjusting brightness. Uh, so those are just quick things that I've done. I probably will end up adding a um, an adjustment mode for setting an alarm. I have plenty of memory left. All the bugs are kinked out. Um, it's all working just fine now. You can see just how beautiful that is. Wow. Look at that. That's stunning. Anyway, yeah, um, the few errors I have on the board, I've already fixed the PCB as well as modified the software to accommodate those fixes. So everything is pretty much good to go. Um, I ordered a new batch of PCBs just to, to double test and whatnot. If you guys are interested in building your own, I will upload the, um, the files once I've verified them in person. But other than that, hopefully you guys have been enjoying these random projects and whatnot. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.